All right. Also, when we were in the shed with Nick and he found the whiskey, I was I kept thinking, are those are those bottles of Nutella? What they look like. He found a bunch of Nutella. Jars of Nutella, rather. Let's see if it's... Something does not seem right. Oh, I guess there's nothing out there. Why is she creeping? Does she need to creep like this? See, something's not right. That is not... That is not Luke. Something is totally wrong here. It's freaking Slender Man. That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go Who away. Who is he? Who is he? Uh, I, I don't what? remember. Hello? Clem, I can't it, breathe. What I, the I heck? can't breathe. Shh. Maybe it's her real father or something. Maybe, maybe what's his name isn't actually her dad. Hello? Hello there. Who are you? Well, actually, I'm your neighbor. Neighbor? That's right. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm He's got a gun. I'm surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? I'm Carly. Carly. That's yeah, I'm not good. You mind if I come in, Carly? I've been out all morning and this heat has got me cooked. Would you please leave? This guy's what's he what's he doing? Nice, nice talking place. fish in the wall. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Sure could pack a lot of folks in there. We have a big group. Lots. Oh? How big? Dozens. They'll be back soon. And they left you here all alone. They must trust you. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. A Spanish guy and his daughter. A quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big black guy, this big, and a pretty little pregnant lady. I saw them. They're dead. You saw who? Where? Down by yeah, the river the other good. day. Walker's got them. I'm sorry. <laughs> the river? You sure about that? Pretty sure. Well, no offense, but I guess that wasn't them. Because the ones I'm looking for are very careful people. If you say so. Telling some good lies here. I think we've thrown, we're throwing this guy off a bit. Well, it looks like a damn tornado ran through here. Must be like close to ten people with you. More. Hmm. A knife, huh? Just passing through, or you've been here a while. Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Uh. Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer there. Oh boy. I don't know how we're gonna get out of this. This guy does not seem like he's gonna just leave willingly. Well, this is a real nice place. Or Kinda maybe cozy. he is. I don't know. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch. But a smart man. What happened to him? Let's just say we had our differences. Sooner or later, people close to you will find a reason to cross you. Happens every time. It's called politics. 
Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. White. Uh oh. What was he that? Farted. It was a very squeaky fart. Don't go up there. I thought you said nobody's here. Nobody is here. Oh, boy. Just Joel and Ellie upstairs. Don't go up there. How are we going to stop this guy? Maybe she's got a hiding place. Yeah, he'll never look under the bed, I'm sure. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. The Who's this? Oh, great. My sister, she's dead. Really? Well, I'm very sorry to hear that. Thanks. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? What's your point? If people don't trust you, how can you trust them? Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. But wait, who are you? You have a real good day now. Oh boy. Don't know what this creepy dude is about. So hard to tell. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? Should have at least made sure he, he actually left the house first. Locked the door. We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Oh, there they are. They're Clementine. back. time. Sarah, you were with Nick, right? We gotta go find him. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. Oh, you boy. calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? El Maybe Diablo. You know damn well who it was. Did he say his name? I didn't ask his name. You didn't ask his name? How could you not ask his name? He had a gun. I didn't want to make him mad. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? He had a mustache. Like mine, or more like Alvin's? Um, it was... Droopy? Droopy. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. All right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not going to do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say I, anything I don't know about this. Some, some, something's weird about that guy, think? too. Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? What were you doing doing pornography? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. I took the picture. It's my fault. No, I asked her to. It's my fault. Sarah. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. Tech. We're moving out. What is Alvin doing? 
we have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. Look, we gotta find Nick on our way out of here. You know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Boy. I don't know which direction this is going. I don't really trust Antonio Banderas, but I certainly don't trust that brown coat guy either. Moving on, huh? Now you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey Clem, sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm She's actually a apologizing, age. wow. It's just a tough time right now, with the pregnancy and all. You and Alvin can probably relate. Why is Carver after you? After me? Oh, you mean us. It's a long story. He... He has a hard Maybe time... Maybe Carver's the father, huh? That I know would be you crazy. Did back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not she's opened it up a little bit. She's not. She, I'm supposed to be a, a mom bit. soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Alvin and I still don't know what to call her, or him if that man gets his wish. <laughs> God help me. Any ideas, Clem? Huh. There, that's where we were. Who took out all these? All these guys? Did Nick really do this? Nick! Get the door. Boy. He's hyped up on Nutella. Watch out. Oh man. Jesus. Hey man. What? You got any aspirin? He's alive. You asshole. He's okay. She's got a hangover, I guess. Pete's dead. I know, man, I do. We gotta get moving. Okay, Carver's gang showed up. Can you make it? Yeah. Yeah. Good, let's go. I guess he didn't. He hopefully, he didn't get bitten or anything. Hey, Clem. Uh, I just wanted to say thanks for not giving up on me. I'm sorry about Pete. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Why is he falling back behind? What happened back there in that cellar? He do something stupid? Look, he can tell me. I'm just looking out for him. He got drunk. I was scared. God damn it, Nick. I'm worried about that kid. <laughs> Little girl's gonna keep you? eye on a grown man. You sure you still want to come with us? Look, I know we got off to a rough start. And I can't make any promises it won't get rougher. I have to look for Krista. She was headed north, right? Yeah. So are we. Look, you're gonna have a better chance of finding her with us than on your own. This is true. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. How good it is for a pregnant woman to be walking that much.
five days later. Well, that was quick. <laughs> no walking quick time events. 